Hey guys, this is your trusted weather forecast, and today we're going to be talking about potential hurricane Iota that will likely impact the Caribbean in the same countries that Ada impacted Nicaragua and the Honduras before likely either curving south into the eastern Pacific or curving north towards the Gulf of Mexico. Before we get into this, I'd like to ask you to subscribe. About 75% of you who watch my videos are not subscribed. So please click the subscribe button if you like weather related content, hit the notification bell if you do not want to miss a single upload. Also, share this with friends and family and like the video to get this out to as many people as possible. Let's get right into this. The National Hurricane Center gives Invest 98L a 90% chance of formation through 5 days and then 80 through 48 hours. The tropical depression is likely to form over the next 24 to 48 hours as the system moves generally westward. A major hurricane is looking increasingly likely. Intensity guidance for Invest 98L soon to be likely Hurricane Iota. Most models have it becoming a hurricane with some going into major hurricane strength including one going to the, into category 5 intensity and showing minimal signs of weakening after hour 120, though some models do have it weakening slightly after that point. This path, the path of the system is pretty uncertain at this time. These are all the potential paths the system could take, and you can see models are split with a Honduras landfall and curving into the eastern Pacific, or a landfall in neither country and it curves towards the Gulf of Mexico where the United States could be at risk depending on what happens after that point and how much dry air is in the Gulf of Mexico. Overall, it is looking like a very bad situation, particularly for the Honduras, which already got rammed by Ada. These are current sea surface temperatures in the Atlantic, and you can see the Caribbean is warm, especially where Invest 98L currently is, with 29 to 30 degrees Celsius waters, but as we get closer to the Gulf of Mexico, those drop to 29 to 28 degrees Celsius, and in the Gulf of Mexico, it can drop below 25 degrees Celsius. These waters, especially in the Caribbean, are enough for the system to rapidly intensify. Question of the day for this video is, what is your favorite activity to do in your free time? Comment your answers below and I will come over. That's just a weather forecast for likely Hurricane Iota. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment if you want. Goodbye.